Game of the Week, presented by Turkish Airlines, Nike, and Intersport. Home, the Turkish Airlines EuroLeague Game of the Week is heating up tonight in beautiful Malaga, Spain, as mighty Ponte Paschi Siena of Italy hits town to face local favorite Unicaja, which needs every one of its faithful fans to help find a much-needed victory. Unicaja hosts Montepaschi at the Martin Carpena and this game could be the last chance for the Spanish team. For us it's very important to win because of two defeats. And now we have another option. Of course it's for us very important. And we will try to to recover our feelings, to recover our feelings of victory that we have in the last game. And the challenge would be tough as Malaga is going to face one of the best team over the whole tournament. They have a lot, a lot of good players in the last year. This year they have one of the best pointers like McAllister, uh, Anderson coming back from the NBA. They are doing everything with a lot of uh, a lot of support from, from the city and from the fans and with a lot of sense since the, you know, the players that they get and uh, to keep the coach with, like I said, from the best. But Siena is of a period made up of injuries, and they're not at their best. Our energy is not on the top mentally first, but obviously we are also an experienced team, and uh, my players know, uh, many of them, that this is a moment to make something extra. Uh, don't think too much if we are perfect, if we are in the shape, if we have uh, the right number of, of practice to have our system. This is the time to play and to, and to fight. Unicaja can count on good players and on the home fans' support. They have very good players all the time. You know, they're very good point guards. They got the home and very, very good. So they play very well at home. You know, they feed off their fans. The fans give them an extra boost. You know, it seems like it seems like they, they don't miss many shots here. So I mean, we have our work cut out for us tomorrow. Everything is ready at the Martin Carpena Arena. Tip off is coming. Roland comes up with rebound. Cross court to Darden. Gets in the lane. Gets it to Freeland for the basket and the foul. Unicaja starts with a 7 0 run led by Freeland. But the visitors answer with a 7 2 partial with the help of Lucy Thornton. Loose ball. He still has it. Swings around to Darden for a three point try and he rattles it in. Mel Darden. With the ball stolen by McCallum with time running out. He finishes and what a finish by Bo McCallum. After a great steal by McCallum to end the first quarter, Jorge Gatajosa sees a three pointer to keep the game close. Gets it into Lavrinovic. The corner swings around to Lakotovic. He finally gets it past the Marco Canadento in the game. Sticks his first shot. Labradinovic for yet another three-corner just on Labradinovic. Darden makes it a 10-point game just before all time. Here's Darden, baseline jumper, puts it down with three seconds left. DJ Roland does his best to have Malaga stay in the game, but Devitinov gives the jumper, and then Labradinovic does the same to stop the 9 0 scoring run. Again. In the post to Labradinovich against Garbajosa. Back and down, spins one hand, her goes right down for Shistov Labradinovich. The coach goes back to Moss, working on the zone. It's going to be Moss from downtown against that zone. Gets the ball to Freeland for a jump shot from the corner, two pointer. Joel Freeland is a top scorer for Unicaja with 14 points, and David Moss scores 20 with 4 out of 6 from the yard to become player of the game and give Siena a great 68-91 for a win. 